Is there going to be any stealth in this game? Because this guy's not equipped for it. Hey, hey. Monitoring tower. Okay, I'm at the site. I don't see anybody around. And a Jenny. Lucky for us. Yeah, lucky for us. E, there is some serious comms equipment out here. Wireless stuff. Yep. What do you mean? I'm talking a big 20 foot tall transmission tower. And they can probably listen to whoever the hell they want. They're nestled down in this valley, which makes it impossible for you or any lookout to see them. Yeah, that's not a good thing. So I guess we're going to continue on. Maybe we'll see another derp deer soon. Looks like there's a gate over there and a green light to our left, which I briefly looked at. There we go. Hmm. I am not too keen on finding out what that stuff is. But we're going to have to. What if the other lookouts aren't actually the original lookouts? I'm in their main tent. I just I wonder where they are. All, all of their stuff is here. And they know you're there, so see what you can find and get out. Alright, I'm trying. I'm in their main tent. What's it like? It's definitely some sort of monitoring station. There we go, map. This definitely looks something like something interesting. movements. The map's got all sorts of paths and areas marked off on it. There are lines that look like some of the paths I normally take. Are you positive it's you? I'm not sure, but I think so. Hmm. I found their main monitoring desk. Oh my god, what do you see? Seriously, at this stage, I'd believe just about anything. Uh, a giant mess. There's a box here with a dial. Make sure no one's sneaking up behind me. Measures earthquakes. You mean like a lie detector? Yeah, I'm not sticking around to get hooked up to it. No, not like a lie detector. Like a seismograph. Someone was in a rush or knocked a bunch of stuff over on accident. I probably heard I was coming. This stuff looks like it just got lifted out of the space shuttle. I have to tell you, if I found out this was NASA, I'd be a hell of a lot happier. They're measuring the barometric pressure, too. Why? Maybe it's just a diversion. There's some sort of monitor. I don't know what it does. Maybe air quality or something? Maybe they're keeping data on everything that could impact our moods. That looks possible. This is crazy. Okay, so there's a log here that tracks the movement of four distinct subjects. You and me? Uh, yeah. Definitely me. And I suppose you too. Let's see. Subject beacon frequency sex social role. Wow, okay. 4022, 433.87 megahertz. Male. M-O. What is M-O? Modus operandi. Frequent departure from two forks area. So that's definitely us. Uh, 914, 433.84 megahertz. Female. Not exactly sure what that means. P-E. Avoidance behaviors. Consult previous data. 3871, 43.92 megahertz. M-O... So male, whatever this is, unreciprocated desire for copulation, conflict with other males. Uh, 42723, disproportionate food intake. So that person's eating a lot more food wherever they're from. It could be... Hmm, no, I'm not exactly sure. idea maybe another couple that's out here do you have any ideas it's just you and me henry yeah i know we'll talk this over and figure out how to get the hell out of here they're both male so it could have been the good ones although i'm not sure why they'd still be out here so they live and work in the same tent yeah it's all one operation it seems like so yeah like us okay as far as i can tell that's everything Hard case. What's in there? I think I found the thing they used to track us. Holy shit. You know, you swear, like, a lot. Not the time, Hank. Anyway, it's called a wave receiver. Looks like it picks up anything that emits a signal. It's got basic orienteering capabilities, everything. Holy. Holy shit, Henry. Yeah, holy shit. You're gonna take it, right? 
Uh, okay, this thing is losing its mind, beeping like crazy. People are probably coming, so we should probably leave. I don't know. I'm gonna go find out. It's not cool. Okay. Let's bring it back up. Southwest is where we actually want to go, but I want to see what this equipment is. And there is all sorts of contraptions and shit out here. Yeah, there is. This equipment is not stuff from the hardware store. Okay. All right. Now they're doing something with the soil out here too. It's all gridded off. Hey, maybe you were right about the lichens. Ha. How you liking that? I really thought I was going to pick up there. Hold on. I got slower. Is it really back in the tent? Because that'd be weird. Alright, hold on. Let's see. Um, what exactly is it finding? Something under the desk? Oh, okay. I got you now. Black box. Let's take a peek at it. Can you stop with the beeping, please? Oh, hey. That's something a little interesting. Reliable, observant, charismatic, selfish. Okay. Guilt ridden. Are you shitting me? What? What is it? There's a folder of. Yeah, let's read this. Subject, Delilah A, age 43, program status review, week 1, 4, which is annual, 6, 10, and 25. Observational traits, reliable, considering alcoholism. <laughs> so, all things considered, alcoholism, she is reliable. Observant, charismatic, selfish, skewed perception of personal history. Okay, because she changed the thing about whatever her ex-lover was. Pertinent, observed facts, never married, no kids, rarely hikes or leaves immediate surroundings. Multiple lovers, despite longtime partner. Does that mean multiple lovers out here, or whose name was Javier? But she's no longer with him, is what she said. Susceptibility to manipulation. So she's not very susceptible to be manipulated. She's at a three out of 10. Supervisor sign off, e.g. Yeah, let's keep this. And let's check out ourselves. Subject Henry M, age 39, program status review. Observational traits, comprehensive explorer, keeps to the path. Prone to anger, passive, guilty, forthright, guarded. Subject overview, subject is fully engaged supervisor. Trust yet to be scientifically proven. All signs point towards full cooperation. Update, subject may be aware of tests. Suggests we disengage if subject decides to leave his post. Oh, okay. Susceptibility to manipulation. We are definitely very prone to be manipulated that is not a good thing supervisor sign off eg we don't have much choice stuff in here about julia like all right it what? didn't say anything about stuff julia there but okay this is what, what does it say about me you said there was one about me and it looks like they've been following me around what i do when i'm out hiking jesus henry do you hear me it says that you, you and your boyfriend are still together what we're not they're messing with us yeah okay and I don't know they what to are. believe. How do they even know who he is? How the hell does this... I'm so sick of letting these people do this to us. We should just burn the place down. Think about it. No, 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 no. Scenario. Look, maybe that's what they want us to do. What do you mean? Can't jump to conclusions like maybe that. Maybe they're trying to push us to the point where we do something crazy. The grass is dry as hell here. It would go up in a second. Yeah, and we would start our own place on fire. Thinking, what if you're right? I, I just don't think we should do anything that we can't undo. Well, maybe it's not the best idea. No, it doesn't seem like it's it. Definitely not the best idea. Ah, uh, so fucking wound up. It's all right. I'm just gonna hike back. We have the wave receiver, and tomorrow we can figure out what to do. Head back to Chief Forks Lookout. Hopefully. 
uneventfully. Although I have a feeling we're going to meet someone up here. And if they're scientists, why would they knock us out? What's this way? A whole heap of nothing. Okay. That's cool, I guess. Alright. See if we can get out of here without altercation. There are three of them. So they could be anywhere for all we know. It's music, though. It's setting a very... Very panicked mood. I'm not liking it. Is there anything to do over here? Besides stare off into the ravine? No. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Make the leap again. Hopefully that doesn't break. <sighs> okay, I don't think they're getting back there. But hopefully they're not anywhere near. Because I don't have anywhere to run if they are. I didn't do it. It wasn't me. <sighs> what do we do? Nothing. We keep moving. Yeah, call in the fire. Go do it. And what about who started it? What about them? It doesn't matter who started it. You can't prove it. Yeah. We're talking about people watching us out here who are now burning the forest and everything in it around us. I I, I don't know what to do about that. Except get the hell out. Call it in. Yes, get us the hell out of here. I will. Wow, that's pretty intense. That is not good. They know so much about us. Things about Julia, too? Have they been in my tower and read my journal? Diary? Holy poop. That's a All right, so we're slowly compiling a bit of information here. I don't really want to use the wave receiver yet. Wow, how, how, how did you put that underneath the photo? Why would you put that? You know what? Get over there, Julia. Alright, so uh, annoyingly, it's going to be going off for a while. No too much. Delilah lying. Okay. July 16th, 1989. What the freak difference a day makes. Holy crap. I don't even know where to begin. It's late past midnight. So I'm going to write down everything that happened today as fast as I can. I went down the lake and found a clipboard and walkie-talkie, and I don't know how to describe this. I don't know what to say other than someone is listening to Delilah and I. I know that sounds crazy, but someone is out here listening to us and attacked me. They're taking notes about our conversations. We think there might be some sort of study going on. Like, maybe we we're given these jobs, not just to look for fires, but to be part of a behavioral study or something. I know this all sounds insane. It is insane. I don't know how to explain any of it. Delilah definitely heard someone on our walkie-talkies, too. It wasn't just me. I'm rambling here. She heard someone, too. I tried calling her a couple times tonight, but we don't want to talk on these anymore. I don't know what we're going to do. Well, we're going to talk on these, because here you go. You're reporting it. Like a signal? It's going beep, beep. Yeah, what could it be? I don't know. you got to find out. All right, I'm on my way now. It could be a trap. I don't really want to go there. No. A fifth of Major Bueno Tequila from the creek. Are you drunk? No. I am getting drunk. Yeah, that's a great idea. Hey D, I don't want to harsh your vibe, but maybe, just maybe, that's a bad idea. Henry, Henry, Henry. What? You're harsh in my vibe. My thinking is. I could stay up all night worried I'm going to lose my job because of the side fire, or I could not worry and let the chips fall where they may. It's not like there's any proof we were down there. My thinking is I'm going to follow this wave receiver. Ooh, I like it when you think. Ay ay ay. I'll just leave you alone with whatever these thoughts are. Yeah, I kind of need you coherent, okay? So if the radio's off, put it away. Thank you very much. I kind of need you coherent for this. We're on radio silence right now, so let's bring out the... Can we run with this thing? Please tell me I can. Yes, we can. Very nice. Shh. Quiet, Mr. Owl. Let's see. West? Southwest. Definitely the way to go. 
Okay. Let's follow this way and see what happens. I don't know why we're doing this at night. It's probably a really bad idea. 